what's up everybody we're letting hdmd here with another video and as you can see we are rocking this uh this this weird layout that we had uh, in our last offensive video because i got a lot of requests to do this again and i got a lot of requests to do a more splash damage defense now, obviously we can't have all of our wizard towers in the middle because this one is still upgrading it's going to take a week but uh it worked out fine because we needed the clan castle up in here anyways and uh and now the only problem with this base is that it's 100% splash damage defended in the middle and up in this uh, this high end champions the armies are very tanky therefore splash damage won't do shit but despite that fact we're gonna try it out anyways and see how this base does 100% splash damage defense in the middle guarding our town hall does in the 3800 cup range alright guys so this first attack we will be getting attacked by Sammy from King's Den and uh, let's see what he's gonna do. Alright, he's gonna have. That's weird, okay. I mean, was it really necessary using the jump spell considering you can place troops in the middle? But I'm not gonna question him because he's the great Sammy. And uh, he's got a, uh, what is like a quad go wipe, we go wipe coming in. On the left side of my base, rage spell down. Okay. Not really understanding why the rage spell was necessary at that place, but you know, again, he's a professional. And uh, now the P.E.K.K.A is going to swing in towards this archer, and these minions are going to be like, we're going to shit on you, and, and that's exactly what they do. And they take that out, he does do the lightning spell down, and it does take out some of my minions and injure some others, and then the wizards out of these troops will finish cleaning it up. And then, yeah, did he just use his ability? He uses his ability for his king and for his queen, and another rage spell. I don't really know what this guy's doing, and uh, well, Gollum did go in the middle though. And uh, honestly, that's going to clean up because really it's only splash damage. So as you can see, they're not doing much against this golem. Now some wizards are going to come in. Uh, the king and all these troops will be swinging. Wait, is the king dead? No, the king's fully alive. Okay, king and all the troops will be swinging around that way. And uh, oh my god. Okay, so all those wizards that went in towards the middle of the base, uh, they all got destroyed by the traps and by the mortars. That was pretty lucky because if they were not targeted, then they would have taken this town hall no problem because these golems are still up. They're still walking around. And they're still destroying all of my defenses, but uh, they are going to go down pretty soon here. So the town hall's still up. The uh, the queen at the top of the base is dead. The king is still going strong, but he's going to swing this way. And now all of these other golems are going to be moving in towards the middle. What the hell? Did you see that? Did you see that air bomb? <laughs> Wait, let's watch that again. Golems are going to be moving in towards the Alright, so as you can see, uh, he did put some minions in. He's only got 10 seconds, though. It looks like he's he's ran out of time. These golems are going to be taking out the rest of these defenses. Five seconds left. There's a minion on the clan castle. The king is still playing on the right side of the base. The raid is going to end. And this guy is going to get an 81% one star on me. So the great Sammy, although he did soak up a decent amount of loot, he got only three cups and only one percent he didn't even he didn't even get my town hall i mean his troops like made a full loop around my base almost taking everything out and then just leaving the town hall just chilling in the middle of the base so i mean that worked pretty well uh, the splash damage in the middle did not defend so well against those against the um, the golems because as you can see they did take out most of the defenses in the middle of the base but hey he only got one star and uh this base did not do bad on the first attack all right guys so here's the next attack we're gonna be getting attacked by el mariachi and uh, this is a pretty interesting one, actually. He's got, what, like four, five golems, six, I don't even know how many golems that's it. That's a shit ton. A bunch of golems, he's got a bunch of wizards, and he also has, uh, what, ten Valkyries? So he's got Valks, he's got golems, and he's got wizards, and he's got his level 40 kings. He's going to be coming in towards the right side of my base. And as you can see, my base is completely stacked on loot right now. Collectors are not full, but they're about halfway there. So uh, I had not checked up on my village, and this guy is going to absolutely own me. And uh, let's see what's happening. So all the golems, the king and queen, a bunch of wizards, and some Valks are going to be going up top around. And then the other troops are going to be going towards the bottom. And unfortunately, I did not have any clan castle troops. So that did not help this raid out at all. But uh, let's see. So he does have a bunch of Valks down here. They're going to be doing a lot of damage. And along with all of these golems at top, these king, the, his king and queen and wizards, they're probably not going to be touched like at all during this entire raid just because of how many damn golems there are at the top of the base. But uh, that's okay. So far, nothing has gone towards the middle of the base. Everything is just making its way slowly around. There's a rage spell down there. Goes a lightning spell, and the Valkyries are just destroying my base. Jeez, up top here too. Well, there's only one little slute left, but you know she's she's still doing work, and uh, those golems are all still alive. My king's gonna finally do something, but he's gonna lock onto that golem, and uh, his his troops are gonna take my king out. And now the golems are finally swinging in towards the middle of the base along with some wizards, but my mortars are going to take care of those guys. It is just raining, raining hell from my mortars right now. There's like, what, four of them going? It's just like, bah, bah, bah. 
and uh, it's popping off, but unfortunately, there is a massive mass of massive golems in the middle of the base. Say that three times fast. And uh, although this mortar and wizard and splash fire is is pretty heavy, it is not going to be nearly enough to take out these golems or the heroes, both level 40, both max. And this guy's going to have absolutely no problem sweeping up the last few per per percentages to pick up that three star. And El Mary Achi is going to get the three star for 17 cups with over one million. Loot stole. This bitch is going to take 570,000 gold, 518,000 elixir, and over 5,700 dark elixir. And the three star and 17 cups. So this was a dick move. But yeah, that was uh, that was not so good, guys. So the, the splash damage in the middle of the town hall with the town hall is not the greatest against heavier attacks. Now let's go see the final replay. All right, for this last raid, we will be getting attacked by Marbo. And he's going to use a, a lure troop. And I had no clan castle troops, man. I've just been, I've been slacking lately, dude. No clan castle troops. I got... I got all this shit around my base, all my all my collectors are full, man. I'm just not on the ball, but what he's going to do, he's going to start his attack off by uh, putting in some, let's see, he's got some golems, he's got some pekkas, and I'm sure his king, there he is, and the queen will be falling soon after, and now uh, let's see how this is going to go. It looks like uh, half of his troops are going to go left, half are going to go right, yeah, the uh, pekka and some golems will go left. Or right, that is not left. I do not know my rights for my lefts. And then some Pekkas, and, or a Pekka, some Golems, and the King and Queen will swing left. Now this raid is probably going to go like last raid, honestly. Uh, these troops are probably going to swing around this way, get through a, quite a bit of stuff. Actually, never mind, this Pekka just got shiitake on. Now it's up to the Golems, and they're going to be going down pretty soon. But on this side of the base, it will most likely be a different story. I'm sure this King will pull these troops in, and they're going to be like, What's up, King? I'm going to kick your ass. And they're going to be like, What's up, Town Hall? I'm going to kick your ass. But uh, our mortar's already firing on them, so they're, they're putting in some work. Yep, here comes the golems, going to be going in towards the middle of the base. Luckily, king and queen will be swinging towards the left outside. But these golems, oh, there's a P.E.K.K.A. in there too, it's game over. Now, I'm sure these golems and these P.E.K.K.A. are going to be able to take out pretty much everything within the middle of my base. Unless, unless these defenses are able to, where's the Tesla on this side? There's like a Tesla, oh, it's probably like over here. Alright, there, oh, there it is, see? Told ya. Now this P.E.K.K.A. is going to be a nasty Juan and take out my town hall. These golems are going to be taken out. Yep, uh, I, I called it. I predicted it. They're going to take out everything in the core. King and Queen still going very strong. I have both of their abilities on the left side. And now the P.E.K.K.A. did die. There's her ugly skeleton. And now it's all up to these golems on the right side to basically tank for all these cleanup troops that he's putting in. And also for the King and Queen. King going to be using a special ability. Queen going to be just sitting behind the king like a wussy and basically taking out as much as she can in this raid is not looking good. Again, the splash damage is just not pulling through for us, guys. I mean, this might work better like down in like maybe like gold or master's league or crystal where people use bars and shit. But like up in high champs where people use like these kind of armies, it's not the best. So uh, they did forget something up the top. How, how did that happen? Oh, because the P.E.K.K.A. The P.E.K.K.A. died. And it was just golems at the top. So, uh, can be using the Queen's special ability just to get those last few powerful hits off and take that out for the three star, aka the 100%, aka minus three cups. Was not terrible, but this guy did get off with over a million in loot. So, again, I mean, just absolutely destroyed for over one million and the three stars. So, I mean, splash damage, not the best up in Champions League. All right, guys, now we are back at home, back at base camp, back in the hood. And we're still rocking this uh, wizard tower and mortar defense. Now, I know a lot of you guys do like this, uh, I, I guess, the serious concept of using different defenses in the middle of the base and seeing how it does defend. So, I mean, if you guys want to see more, go ahead and just throw in the comments, like, what defense do you guys want us to put in the next video? And, uh, and if you haven't already liked the video, to make sure that I know that y'all are liking this shit because I'm suffering from it. If you look at my defensive log, I'm getting my ass kicked. All right, it's, it's for you guys, okay? I, lo I love you guys. I love you guys so much. But yeah, guys, we'll most likely do more, so just throw in the comments what defense you want to see in the middle of the base next. Now, with that out of the way, let us get to the comment question of lay day. And it comes from Wyatt Smith. Question is, why do you have to put your two cents in, but it's only a penny for your thoughts? Where's the extra penny going? Good question, Wyatt Smith. And I think I know the answer to where it's going. I think what happened with that one penny, where it's going, it's going to the Why the Fuck Is My Queen So Stupid research fund, uh, the official research fund, to, uh, to determine why the fuck the queen's so stupid. But yeah, guys, if you enjoyed this video, make sure to leave a like. Leave your comment questions of the day down in the description to be picked, possibly for next video. Uh, also, throw down in the comments, what defense do you guys want to see in the middle 
of Lay Base to defend against Lay Assholes in Champions League. We will try out some new stuff and, and just kind of see what works better. But uh, yeah, guys, this will be the end of the video. Again, like if you guys have not already. And I will see you guys in the next video. I love you all. Peace. The pretty girls in class still they never reply but never say never they never get caught on my mind i'm trying to get better and grind measure my effort and skill gets better in time fresher than ever and i am who i am no taking it back i'm alive and well well what to do my name is unimportant but what i say is quite amazing i hope you